In news now, legal challenges could come as early as today after a Dane County judge granted an injunction against the state's new voter ID law. And so right now, voters will not need a photo ID when they go to the polls. Melissa McCready is live at a downtown polling place with more on this decision. Melissa, good morning. A good morning, Vincent Susan. Next month, voters will be casting ballots at polling places like here at the Zeidler building, but they won't need their IDs, at least not for now. A Dane County judge strikes down the law that forces you to show an ID at the polls. This is a great day. Call it a temporary victory for groups like the NAACP and Voces de la Frontera. Judge Flanagan's uh, decision was an affirmation of the sanctity of voting rights. Judge David Flanagan wrote, Wisconsin now has the benefit and the burden of the single most restrictive voter eligibility law in the United States. Republicans, though, strongly disagree, planning an appeal to the ruling, responding, quote, requiring photo identification to vote is common sense. We require it to get a library card, cold medicine, and public assistance. And that challenge could come as early as today. So what does the Government Accountability Board have to say about this sudden change? I'll let you know coming up at 530. For now, on your side, live in Milwaukee, Melissa McCready, today's TMJ4. Okay, Melissa, thank you.